It is the terrifying moment the NFL stood still. And the sports world and millions of fans held their breath. 24-year-old Damar Hamlin collapsed on the field after making what seemed like a routine tackle, suffering cardiac arrest. Players from both teams joined hands and knelt in prayer as paramedics furiously fought to get Damar's heart beating again. After 16 minutes of treatment and nine minutes of CPR on the field, Damar was loaded into an ambulance and was rushed to UC Hospital locally. What was supposed to be one of the biggest games of the year has been suspended until further notice. It's about a young man at 24 years old that was living his dream, and now he fights for his life. From ESPN last night. Buffalo Bills safety DeMar Hamlin. He collapsed on the field last night. Buffalo Bills safety DeMar Hamlin suffering cardiac arrest. The Bills have confirmed it was cardiac arrest. To every morning show today, this tragic injury was what everyone was talking about. It was one face out there on the field, and that was of deep concern. With support pouring in from fans and all over the NFL, DeMar is still listed in critical condition. Now the question is, how can this happen to a 24-year-old athlete in the prime of his life? Joined by our friend, the CEO of USC Verdugo Hills Hospital here in Los Angeles, Dr. Dorian. When I saw this hit, immediately I knew it's not the hit. Right? I mean, that was a standard hit. It could be just a slight hit, but there was a pre-existing condition that was enough to trigger it. The heart is put into a shock. Once it gets hit like that, it, it falls out of rhythm. Normally, the heart's beating like this. As soon as it gets hit, it starts fibrillating, which means it's not pumping anymore. Ironically, Damar is known as a guy with a huge heart. He had started a charity drive to raise just $2,500 to buy toys for underprivileged kids. After last night, the total has passed $4 million. And we turn now to Jordan Rooney, who is a close personal friend of DeMar Hamlin's and a spokesperson for the family. Uh, Jordan, we, we know that DeMar's mother rode in the ambulance with him. She was there by his side. Who is with her at the hospital right now as far as family? His mom, his dad. I mean, honestly, he just has like a huge extended family. There's, there's a lot of people on their way as well. Um, and then some people from the Buffalo Bills organization are here as well. What is the energy like right now? Is it hopeful? Is it tense? If you don't know DeMar, you would probably expect things to be more tense. Um, but we all know DeMar really well. And DeMar is someone that we're confident can overcome anything. So where it is, you know, it is a scary scene for his parents just because there's a little bit of uncertainty. Um, they know their son. This was supposed to be a very important game for dominance in the AFC. And now as this young man fights for his life, football doesn't, of course, matter. Echoing what DeMar himself said after a teammate was injured earlier this season. It's like real life stuff going on, you know. Um, life is bigger than football. 